Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel if you're new here, hi hello I'm Lydia and today I'm doing a life update slash mental health update <laughs> So I haven't talked about my mental health for the last three months. So let's have an update on what's been going on. But before that, look at how cute these doggies are. They're so cute. I've had so much fun hanging out with doggies this Christmas. My mum has two Shih Tzus and my nan has two Shih Tzus. So we love Shih Tzus. So yeah. A lot has changed the last few months. I met a mental health support worker who is lovely. I got to raise concerns that I had around my sleep because my sleep has become a big, big issue. Because I'm not on any sleeping tablets, I'm not on clonazepam anymore. My health care has been reduced and I can't buy Prepazine over the counter anymore. So yeah, my sleep has become a big problem. I don't sleep for nights on end. I just don't sleep. So that's the thing. Clonazepam. Now, we've had a lot of conversations about clonazepam on this channel. We spoke about the benefits it had and how I didn't have a problem taking it, which I don't. I don't have a problem taking benzos. So I don't take clonazepam anymore. I reduced the dose gradually. I went from 3mg a day to no, nothing. And I'm doing okay. My anxiety is a bit up and out of control. But I, I can manage it. My haloperidol dose has been reduced. I was on 10 milligrams and now I'm only on 5. I just only see a psychiatrist once every 3 months. Other than that, my medication is still the same. My lithium's at 800 milligrams still. And I've been good. I've been genuinely enjoying life. And I've spent Christmas with my family. Which has been challenging and hard. I find it very triggering when it comes to food and obviously Christmas and New Year involves eating a lot of meals I'm someone that struggles with meals so I, I snack normally throughout the day when I'm in my own flat so that's been a challenge but it's a challenge that I believe I have met with the same four, so that's a bonus. And I've been genuinely happy. Now the trolling has kind of died down. It's been peaceful and nice and I'm happy to be alive. But yeah, it's been a good few months and I think that I've done really well. I've been out of hospital since May, which is a huge, huge deal. And that's all I've got for this update. Thank you guys so much for your support and thank you for watching what I've been doing and thank you for bearing with me while I've been on a kind of break while I've been at uni and yeah, and just thank you for your support. It's appreciated in more ways than I can explain. Thank you, stay safe, stay strong. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.